All right, I'm gonna film a uh, driving video here in my 79 Ford F-150. Um, this is a, a 351 V8 truck, um, uh, four speed with a granny low, four wheel drive. Um, it's uh, a real nice driver, um, 81,200 miles, uh, no rust. I mean, obviously there's some little surface rust spots and all, but there's no bad rust at all in the truck. Uh, really solid. It's from uh, Utah. It was a farm truck in Utah. Um, I bought it out of there and uh, Probably been kept inside judging by the paint and I was in pretty decent shape um, Nice interior seats been recovered for sure, but it's real nice um, good door cards um, Interiors really great AM radio works. Um, it's a custom model um, so base model um, all the lights and electrical work um, had a lot of recent maintenance and tune-up stuff done, uh, so it runs great. Um, great clutch, great transmission, four-wheel drive works perfectly. Um, the hubs are in great shape. It's got good tires on it, um, just on the brakes. Um, yeah, all-around great truck. So anyways, let's go take it for a spin. Um, it is warm. Uh, I was driving it earlier today, so it's not totally cold start here. Um, I'll fill the, film a cold start later. Uh, it is cold here, though. We're in Fort Collins, Colorado, so 5,200 feet or something. Um, and it's like 29 out today, so it's fairly cold. Um, okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. Yeah, the, uh, it's got great clutch, and the, the trans is really tight. Um, there's no slop in it. The steering's really tight it's got recent shocks on it um, it uh, it's a, just a real nice driver for sure um, I drive it every day um, you can see over there I've got a newer Dodge which I'm actually getting rid of because I like driving an older truck more um, anyways here we go uh, power steering power brakes So, here I'll start it. Here's the granny low first. And then this, so there's granny low first, no clutch. You can just creep all day long. Especially in four low with that gear, it's pretty ridiculous. <laughs> okay, Let's start off in second. Um, the alignment's good, drives real straight. The steering wheel, when it was aligned was not perfectly straightened so I may get that fixed soon um, it's kind of annoying so you'll notice when we're going straight up here that the wheel sits cocked just a little to the left um, uh, which is pretty minor but it, it annoys me a little bit and I drive it a lot um, hey. works great um, Heater core was just flushed uh, out, so the heater works great. Uh, the lower fan works great. Get pretty warm in here pretty quick with all the heater running. But just real, real solid transmission. Shifts excellent. Um, yeah, we'll stop and engage the four-wheel drive as well in a minute. But let's get out on the road so you can see it in different kinds of traffic. Um, yeah, you know, these are great, I guess there's probably see that one. These are great old trucks, um, to be drivers. They're cheap, you know, to maintain, really reliable, cheap to keep on the road. Um, And, you know, I, I love driving the four speed. I think it's awesome. I had some buddies think it was ridiculous to drive an old uh, four speed in traffic daily, but you know what? I love it. Um, motor's really healthy, it runs great. It is a long bed. Uh, has the built-in tie-down hooks on the bed, which is nice. Um, 
tailgate has some dings in it, but the latches work great. Uh, you can see that the dings in the picture. Not uh, surprising for a foam truck. Good rubber uh, floor mat interior, solid floors. Headliner's in nice shape. And it'll do, I drive it down to Denver um, every now and then. It, it does just fine on the freeway. You know, you'll, you'll do um, about 70 is where this thing's happy. It'll do 75, even up to 80 if you need to, but uh, there's no overdrive, so perfectly fine on the freeway, but definitely not great gas mileage for a freeway commuter. this on the heat setting even without the blower running you get enough warm air in here that you're certainly not cold okay hubs are locked okay there's four high Okay, it's four low. 
ridiculously low. So there's clutch out, first in the transmission, four low. I'm not going to take it on the dirt. That'd be a lot more reasonable to show you in the dirt, but I've got it clean right now. So, um, so if anybody needs a video of that, I'm happy to, and film it from the outside if you need. Um, let me go back up here, and we'll do a walk around. Okay, check out the outside video in just a second. <laughs> 